Good evening everyone and first may I apologise for not being there with you to attend the graduation in person. It would have been a great excuse to have been able to visit your beautiful island again but unfortunately as you're all aware in the UK we have a few issues we need to deal with. I'd like to take this opportunity though to congratulate all the graduates today not only for their success in graduating but also for choosing to become victim supporters and making a difference to the lives of those who have been affected by gender-based violence. On my recent visit to Dominica, I met some truly inspiring people from many different organisations and I was very um, impressed with the work that they're doing to try to um, advocate change and ensure that the voices of those who have not a voice are heard. It became really apparent to me that the widespread problem of gender-based violence is not only in Dominica but across the Caribbean and that there are some real ch challenges that need to bring about change with the wheels of change really needing to be oiled. Therefore I encourage all NGOs to continue the important work that they are doing and eventually those wheels will bring change. I hope that in the coming weeks the Dominican uh, Parliament will sit so new amendments to the Sexual Offences Act are heard and are incorporated in order to send a very clear message that gender-based violence will not be tolerated. Once again, I'm sorry that I won't be there in person and wish each and every one of you success in your important roles and look forward to meeting you sometime in the future. Wishing you well. Thank you very much.